Good morning. Um, I just wanted to real quick before I went out and started my day, kind of post a real quick video. Um, I don't know when I'll put it up, but I just wanted to get it recorded because it's it's on my heart, right? I uh, I was just like sitting doing like my morning routine. Every morning it's kind of different. It switches up. Like you know, I'll have I have like um, different books of like daily meditation, some like spiritual or religious, some about recovery that I use to kind of get my day started, and then I kind of switch it up. I don't use the same one every day. Rarely do I do that, but. I also hit my knees and I pray and I don't hit my knees every morning. You know, I'm kind of an anxious person. I got an anxious personality. So sometimes I feel rushed, but I pray about that too. I know God knows my heart and, um, you know, I ask him to help me with that daily. But I'm thinking today, like I'm getting ready to go into the city in the uh, downtown Philadelphia to do some, um, some training and, or not some training, some, some orientation stuff. And I'm thinking about like I'm kind of like feared up like I'm just for some reason like being like in corporate buildings like meeting people um, a little outside my element thus far in my life like I've never you know not really been in the atmosphere a whole lot makes me kind of nervous you know what I mean um, the type of work I've done rarely have I been in in those kind of situations and um, I'm very outgoing I feel like I'm very personable but I still get really anxious I'm still nervous about doing that kind of stuff. And I'm sitting here praying just now and it hit me. It was real powerful, like between reading the couple things that I was reading out of like Jesus Calling and a Hazleton app that I have. I'm thinking like how powerful it is when I can trust and let my confidence about my abilities rely just on God. You know what I mean? Like leave it alone tell myself that I have to accept the things that I, I can't change and that I have to accept the things that I can't see yet because I can't do anything about them and um, have confidence through God that I'm going to be who I'm going to be and they're going to like it or not or you know accept me or not accept me but there's nothing I can do about it. All I can do is be the best person that I can be and um, I want, just wanted to share that real quick because that's really um, – it's really powerful for me when, when, I, when I, I can think like that. I just feel – when I think like that and, I, and, and then I, I kind of just – I take a deep breath and I kind of just like breathe. I'm like, it kind of just leaves. You know, it just, like all that anxiety leaves. Now, like will it, <laughs> will it come back? Will it come back in 20 minutes like when I'm, when I'm up there or whatever? I mean it might, but um, – I got to take a deep breath, focus on my breathing for a second, shoot up a quick prayer. You know, God help me out, man. I need, I need some help. Um, you know, just let things be how they're going to be. Um, remove this anxiety from me if, if you can. If not, use it. You know what I mean? Use it. Use me as an instrument of your love and peace. And that's something that I pray for uh, every day, that I can be used. Not, not, not the way I want to be used in, 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 in situations. Cause sometimes I can be selfish and sometimes I can want what I want, you know, but I know that God has plans that I don't even know about. I have no idea what they are. So, and they're probably a lot better than my plans. <laughs> so, um, good morning and I hope everybody has a great day and thank you for listening.